to my channel. I hope you all are doing great. I am so excited to share my fall decorate with me for 2022 today. I'm gonna to be decorating our living room and dining room area. And then next week I'll share our kitchen decor and the coffee station. And after that, I'll have several more fall decorate with me videos. So make sure that you are subscribed and turn on that notification bell so you get notified when I post a video. Last week I shared a fall decor haul, so I'll link that and I will be sure to link as much decor as I can down below. I hope that you get some ideas today and enjoy. When we wake, hear the birds and see the Setting everything out like this helps me see what I'm working with when I'm decorating and just makes it easier. I'm using lots of neutrals, wood tones, some rust and brown colors, as well as different types of stems and just trying to make everything really cozy. On this side table, I'm using some books that will give height to a pumpkin and then adding a picture vase with some stems. I wanted to incorporate different fall colors throughout my decor, so I did that with different colored stems and pillows, but still tried to tie everything together with sticking to mostly neutral colors and all the decor on this side table are things that I've used from previous years so I definitely reuse my seasonal decor as well as add in some new pieces too before I sleep hear the cricket see the moon side by side and through and And for this little cozy nook on the table, I'm going to add some pumpkins with a wooden bowl and a vase filler which I got from Hobby Lobby and it's just so easy to decorate with and can look so pretty in many spaces throughout your home. I also got some beautiful vase filler with dried oranges that I plan to use with my kitchen decor next week so I'm excited for that. For the knitted throw that I'm adding here, the rust color will tie in with some of the pillows that I'm going to add to our couch, which I love using different materials when it comes to throws and pillows. It just adds so much more dimension to your decor. So I have this cream velvet one and then I got these new linen pillow covers from Amazon and I love them. They were so affordable for such great quality covers and the linen material just looks really beautiful. The color is just neutral enough to add other colored pillows here and they have so many other colors to choose from so I'll link them below and of course I'll link everything from the decor that's available but if I miss anything let me know in the comments. Yesterday, there was sun and there was rain. For the coffee table, I'm adding more of those pretty neutral colors and starting with decor books which I love, love, love to use in my decorating and these two are a great option if you love neutrals that can be used for any season. And then this wood bowl is a recent Target favorite and I'm just going to fill it with some pumpkins. Track of time, 
adding this vase from Target with some dry floral stems that I got from Joann's and I really love them. I think they're beautiful and are just a very unique style floral and all of this together I think just adds lots of warmth and texture and then I'm going to finish off with a candle of course to make our home smell like fall. For the dining table, I got this gorgeous vessel from our house and I'm going to add these beautiful plum stems from a floral. I love that dark moody color that they add and how they contrast with the vase as well as the height that they add to the table. This woven tray is from Target a few months ago, but they might still have it. And then just adding some acorns from Hobby Lobby. For the decor in the hutch, I'm keeping it pretty neutral and just adding some brass and wood tones as well as a few pumpkins. These small pictures are some of my favorites and perfect for fall decor and even if you just use a few pumpkins but use items like these with those fall tones and different textures you can create a very cozy fall decor look which is what I'm trying to go for in all of my spaces. And again, just adding some vase filler to this bowl with a little pop of orange. Also ended up adding a garland with some stems on the top of the hutch and I think it is a good pop of texture and it just adds more of a fall look to the hutch so I really love how it turned out. Get some rest I'm by your side Lay your head on my chest I've 
had a really bad day. Our home is starting to look and feel so cozy and it gets me so excited for fall to actually get here soon and I can't wait to decorate the kitchen and the rest of the house so make sure that you are subscribed so you don't miss any of the videos I hope you guys got some fall decor inspiration and ideas for your decorating thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next one Thursday.